It's me again, Bicolana Hardinera, and welcome sa ating channel! So, for today's video, guys, ayan, I will show you another trick that I use for my plants. So, aside from this one, aside from using sea salt solution, drive, and this granules, for my uh, plants as fertilizer and uh, root growth enhancer I will show you what I also used an organic one I use this one guys I use stale milk any brand of milk is uh, accepted this one is a stale milk. I forgot to use it. And now, it will not turn into waste because I will uh, use this one as my uh, fertilizer for my indoor or outdoor plants. So to start making our stale milk solution as fertilizer for our plants, let's first set aside the drive the granules and the sisal solution we only need a stale milk for this kind of method any brand is fine eight liters of water rain water or tap water is fine a dipper and a measuring cup if you are going to use tap water leave it for two to three days before using it in this type of watering then measure one and a half cup of stale milk and pour it into the water and mix and so ready na siyang gamitin para sa ating mga succulents and indurable plants so ayan guys ang aking mga indurable plants i also use this one guys for my succulents but i do butt chugging i don't want to pour it uh, on top of the succulents i use butt chugging underneath the pot and so for butt chugging for our succulents we need uh, to use a hollow shallow dish this one and we were going to pour water and milk solution on it and on the other one Think it's too much yeah. and and we will put our succulent plants on it this type of watering technique takes time so you need to be patient wait until the top part of the soil is soaked with the milk solution before removing the potted succulents out of our milk solution using syringe is also perfect for this type of watering technique but guys if i'm using this milk and water for uh, watering my plants i don't water them directly on top of the succulents or cactus because it will uh, leave stains on the leaves and 
it might cause root uh, leaves rotting. So better to be safe. Ni uh, you you can use syringe, or you can uh, gently pour on the cor corner of the pot. Don't uh, water them on top of the leaves of our cactus and succulents. Same as uh, when I'm uh, using it for my indoor plants. Even if they are big, I'm using uh, or I'm pouring the milk and water solution slowly just on the soil part of our plants. By the way guys, you can uh, also buy bigger size for this syringe if you can find one, much better. This one needs more effort because it's too small. <laughs> but I like this one. As I uh, can spend more time on my plants. So it's fine with me but as I've said if you can find bigger one better the bigger the better you can finish faster and so easy but I like uh, when if it's small I like it. And these are the last potted succulents for our butt chugging technique using the milk solution. And if you like our video for today, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my YouTube channel. And click the bell button para lagi kayong updated sa mga videos niya upload ko palagi. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.